Hi, I'm Crystal Janes. I'm a nurse practitioner with PHC. I'm here to introduce to you our telehealth workstation. Um, the benefits of telehealth are, um, there's numerous, but just to list a few. Um, we have, our goal is to reduce hospitalizations, um, improve clinical outcomes, um, minimize um, patient transport to the hospital, um, and of course, lower cost for the patient. Um, in order to do this, you are gonna have to contact the provider first. You can either text them or call them, whoever it may be, um, just to let them know that, hey, we have a patient, we have an issue, you know, we need your assistance. So after you've contacted them, they're gonna come to the station. There's a button on the side, you just turn it on, click it once, swipe up. There's an uh, Amazon Alexa app, you're gonna click it. Down here at the bottom, there's a um, communicate, you're gonna click on that. And then at the top here, there's a drop-in button. Click that. Whoever the provider is that you're contacting that's on, say it be myself, it would be Crystal Jane's exam two. You click on that to contact me. If it were Dr. Saba, you'd contact him. Whoever it may be, they'll be on this list. For today, we are in exam room 17. And then it's gonna connect. It takes a minute. Um, you'll see yourself here. This will be fuzzy for just a minute, just for privacy. Um, and then once the provider gets on, you'll see them. There we go, nice and clear. So you'll take this entire station into the patient room with you. Um, the patient, this is gonna be the patient that's popping up. The provider can see them, you see them, and you see yourself as to what's going on in the screen. Um, CMS only requires a um, two interface device, meaning you can see them, you can hear them, and vice versa. We have something additional to that. We have a stethoscope. So to turn that on, you're going to click the button on the iPhone that's already connected to the station. And the same way that we did it with connecting here, we're going to connect here also. There should have been a, a drop-in button, but um, so if you were connecting to me again, it would be the same way. It would be Crystal Jane's stethoscope because this is the stethoscope that we're using, not the main um, device. So you'd click on that. Sorry, just scroll till you find it. Here we go, stethoscope. And it's gonna pop up as well. And again, it is all connected to the same workstation, so it's not like you're going around trying to fumble through and find things, it's all here. And it's just this tiny device, connects through the cord, you'll turn it on, and you'll be able to, um, the provider can instruct you to um, listen to the lung sounds, the bowel sounds, heart sounds, whatever it may be. Um, there's also a pair of ears on here for you so that you know that you're in the right spot and you hear exactly what the provider's hearing also. At the end, once um, you don't have to have this plugged in while you're in the room with the patient, it is battery operated, but it is very important that whenever the um, visit is completed that you do put everything back together in its place and make sure it's plugged into the wall so it is charged for the next time that you go to use it. All right, um, that is it. I uh, Oh, on our website, um, telehealthflorida.com, you can see um, further tutorials on the tablet as well as the stethoscope. All right, I hope to hear from you soon. Thank you.